I am now going to be reading um, the stuff that happened 2,000 years ago with Jesus. It is the Holy Week, the Passion Week and what Jesus did for us. This past Sunday, in the same week obviously, the event, Triumphal Entry into Jerusalem, Matthew 21, 1-11. Also, Mark 11, 1 to 10. Jesus looks around the temple. Mark 11, 11. Jesus returns to Bethany. Also, Mark 11, 11. Jesus curses the barren fig tree. Matthew 21, 18 to 19. And Mark 11, 18. Jesus cleanses the temple. Luke 19.45-48 Mark 11.15-18 Certain Greeks ask to see Jesus. And that's um, John 12.20-36 Jesus Rebukes unbelief. John 12 37 to 50. Jesus returns to Bethany. Mark 11 19. And that was Monday. On Tuesday of the week, disciples see the fuller withered fig tree. Matthew 21:19-22 and also um, Mark 11:20-26 20, Jesus's authority questioned by leaders Luke 21-8 um, and John 11:27-33 Parable of the two sons Matthew 21, 23 to 27. Parable of the fine dresses. Matthew 21, 33 to 46. John 12, 1 to 12. Oh, sorry, Mark 1 to 12. Do apologise. Parable of the wedding feast. 22, 1 to 14. That's um, in Matthew. Pharisees question about paying taxes. Matthew 22, 15, 22. Pharisees question about the resurrection. Matthew 22, 23, 33. Scribes question about the great commandment. Commandment. Uh, Mark 12, 28, 34. Jesus' question about David's Lord. Luke 20, 41 to 44. War to the scribes and Pharisees. Matthew 23, 1 to 39. Mark 12, 38 to 40. Poor widow's might. Mark um, 12, 41 to 44. Luke 21, 1 to 4. Prophecy of destruction of Jerusalem and the Lord's coming. Matthew 24, 1-51, Mark 13, 1-37. Parable of the Ten Virgins, Matthew 25, 1-13. Parable um, of the Talents, Matthew 25, 14-30. Parable of the Sheep and the Goats, Matthew 25, 31-46. And on Wednesday, um, San Hedrin plots to kill Jesus. Luke 22, 1 to 2, as well as Mark 14, 1 to 2. Judas agrees to betray Jesus. Matthew 26, 14 to 16. Thursday. The preparation 
preparation of the Passover, which is Matthew 26, 17 to 19. Jesus and the disciples assemble for the Passover feast. Mark 14, 17 and John 13, 1. Disciples argue over who is the greatest. Um, Luke 22, 24, 30. Jesus washes the disciples' feet. Um, John 13, 2 to 17. Jesus identifies his betrayer. Matthew 26, 21 to 25. Jesus institutes the Lord's Supper. Luke 22, 15 to 20. The commandment of love. Luke 13, 31 to 35. Jesus predicts Peter's denial. Mark 14, 27, 31. Jesus gives discourse in the upper room. John 14, 1 to 30. Jesus and the disciples sing a hymn and depart the upper room. Matthew 26.30 And on Friday, Jesus' um, discourse on the way to Gethsemane. Gethsemane. Gethsemane, sorry. <laughs> And that's John 5, 1 to 6, 33. Jesus prays for his disciples. John 17, 1 to 6. 6 sorry, 17, 1 to 26. Jesus prays in Gethsemane, which is Matthew 26, 36 to 46. Jesus is betrayed and arrested. Um, Luke 22, 47 to 53. Jesus is brought before Annas, John 18, 13-14. Um, that happened from noon. Um, but Sorry, not noon. 12am, um, 3am. Jesus is brought before Caiaphas, um, John, um, eighteen twenty-four. Jesus is commanded and mistreated by the Sanhedrin and throughout the night. Um, Luke twenty-two fifty-four, as well as sixty-six seventy-two. Peter denies Jesus three times. Um, Matthew 26, 58, as well as 69 to 75. Sanhedrin formally condemns Jesus. Mark 15, 1. Judas goes out and commits suicide. Matthew 27, 3 to 10. 6 a.m. Jesus appears before Pilate. Luke 23, 1 to 7. Jesus appears before Herod. Um, Luke 23, 8 to 12. Jesus appears before Pilate again. Um, Mark 15, 6 to 14. Jesus is scourged and mocked by the Romans. John 19, 1-3. Now from 9am, this is the Friday, um, Pilate consents to Jesus' death. Matthew 27, 22-26. Jesus is led away to be crucified. John 19, 16 to 17, Jesus on the cross for the first three 
powers mark 15 24 32 and from noon Jesus on the cross for the final three hours Luke 23 44 and 46 miracles accompanying the crucifixion Matthew 27 51 56 3 p.m. Joseph buries the body of Jesus Luke 23 50 to 55 Jewish leaders secure the tomb on Saturday that was all Friday on Saturday the women observe the Sabbath day Luke 23 56 and on Sunday the women come to the tomb and find Jesus risen and that's Matthew 28 1 to 8 I really feel something strong the Holy Spirit is real my friends it is part of the Trinity and we can't ignore the Holy Spirit not once it is part of our God I really felt that really strong just then and yeah and th th that scripture the women come to the tomb to find Jesus it's all in the four Gospels and John 21 as well and 